was a very huge stigma on me that stopped me from going to school, stopped me from going around friends. Even my girlfriend, my sister was together. She had to leave me because of this condition. Where we wear wet trousers, before 30 minutes, the trousers will get soaked and the room will be smelling. So it can't permit me to say that my friends, all my friends shy away from me. So it caused a very bad stigma for me. I won't associate with anybody. We are designing an intervention package which will be piloted in Liberia and we anticipate that at the end of our intervention packages, our research, we will have developed an optimal model which will be effective, efficient, sustainable, accessible, available and gender sensitive toward the delivery of SSA services in Liberia. A package that will be replicable to other parts of Liberia West Africa and beyond Africa. Skin Health Africa Research Program, SHARP, will address severely stigmatizing skin diseases. We've brought together a highly multidisciplinary team comprising social scientists, clinicians, economists of different backgrounds, bringing perspectives from their various disciplines to enrich the program. You might remember as a child grazing your knee and forming a scab. And when the scab came off a few days later, the skin underneath was miraculously healed. Maybe substances in the scab were promoting healing. We plan to test this idea in people affected by leprosy ulcers using the patient's blood. My colleagues at Amanda Van Hospital in Kathmandu will make a kind of artificial scab. They will then use this to dress the ulcer and we'll evaluate this treatment, which has been widely used, but never properly evaluated. And if it works, it will have implications not just for leprosy, but for more common diseases where ulcers are caused by nerve damage, most especially diabetes. The impact we want to achieve is to end neglect of the two conditions, protocols and scabies. We want to increase focus of social science in the uh, neglected tropical disease agenda. And at the community level, we want to develop strategies on social science intervention for implementers. We want to increase awareness and lower stigmatization of these two diseases with endemic communities. And we want to develop more effective tools to measure experience of the stigma and the life quality of those affected by the disease. We are leading a large global health research project called Eclipse. We're working on a neglected tropical disease called cutaneous leishmaniasis, or CL. The experiences and challenges that people with CL face may be very different across the world. The Eclipse team is working in Brazil, Ethiopia and Sri Lanka, which have very different healthcare systems, cultural context and socio-economic challenges. And at the very heart of all Eclipse activities is robust engagement with the local communities in Ethiopia, Brazil and Sri Lanka.